welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel in this practical video i will guide you how to place steel reinforcement in the construction of rcc slab as you can see guys practically the floor beam is already completed and the size is 12 by 18 inches inside this floor beam we placed steel reinforcement which dia is 12 mm for main bars and distribution bars guys you can see clearly the spacing is 12 by 12 inches after completion of singly mesh we will provide the other mesh on the top of this then the spacing will be 6 by 6 inches now this is singly mesh before placing of steel reinforcement we did or we place the plastic guys you can see clearly the span between two columns is here long span is and short span we have the long span is 26 feet and the short span is 14 feet you can see guys on the other side guys you can see this is cantilever slab which is already on the top of the cantilever beam You can see the size of the column is 18 by 18 inches with 12 number of steel rods. The dia is 20 millimeter. This is floor beam construction. Four bars at the bottom, three at the top. Dia is 16 millimeter. Stirrup dia is 10 millimeter with the spacing of 7 inches. Hooks are bent on 90 degree. It should be provided or bent on 135 degree. Guys, you can see the spacing of stirrup is same. At the distance of L by 4, the spacing should be closely. After L by 4, you can increase up to 8 inches. Thickness of the slab will be 6 inches. Guys, you can see the steel reinforcement we have main bars on the top of this we have distribution bars because main bars should be placed before distribution bars because distribution bars load transfer the load to main bars and main bars transfer to the beams and beam transfer to the column because this is frame structure building which is four story guys you can see also after completion of doubly mesh they will place concrete cover which is 40 millimeter this is cantilever beam length is seven feet okay guys this is a short video for some important information related RCC slab, beam and column. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.